Freebie Cycles here with a video on using wavelets for Microsoft Excel and the subject today is finding lows, market lows. So I'll, um, I'll put a link in the description for downloading this um, Excel add-in and um, it only works at older systems, 32-bit uh, systems as far as I know. So you probably need a, an older computer for it. Um, and um, just showing you, um, after uh, having installed it, you will find it on the menu line. And um, here I have uh, the uh, data for SMP. The date, the closing value, and uh, wavelets uh, have some um, endpoint trouble. Uh, uh, what I do, uh, I usually add some 10 to 15 data points with the same value as the last closing value. So uh, you run, I run this uh, add in with uh, standard settings. Uh, I, we, you choose data format. I have columns for date and close, so that's the correct setting. I want my data starting on column E. So I load the data, I compute the wavelet, and um, what I get is uh, these columns for seven wavelets. Uh, and I show them here in a diagram. Here I have uh, removed scale 1 and 2 and the 7th. So normally when I make my videos I show you the wavelet scales uh, let me think 3, 4 and 5. No, is it 5, 4 or 6? <laughs> I can't remember. Um, anyway, uh, let's switch over to the analysis today using these wavelets to find market lows. So I start uh, e with some easy examples. So this was the bear market low uh, and I'm primarily, primarily looking at this um, purple wavelet and sometimes the yellow one. So this rectangle is about 26 days wide. So here we are here we were at the market or low. So could I know that at this point it was a market low? Well, I put this at the wavelet top. It's about 26 trading days and we see that's where I want to look for a market low. And that turned out right. That was a market low. Now I have to say this is bu for bull market rules we will come back to bear market. And at this point we were still in the bear market. So probably here you would expect using a low using bear market rules and that would be a, a later and lower low. But here we had a low using bull market rules. So we go up to the next market low. That was the actual market low. Could I know that this was a market low? Again we have this rectangle placing it at the top of the wavelet and it shows us we should look for a low around here. Also also I should point out I always always look for A, B, C patterns in in market corrections when looking for market lows. I should also mention that finding market lows is probably m more easy than finding market tops. And that's an no totally another different subject, finding market tops. So today it's market lows. So here we have a clear ABC pattern. It also is shown by the, this yellow wavelet, ABC. Going back here as well, we have an ABC pattern. That's always what I look for. In, a, in addition, we were at, at the time where we should look for a low. We had an ABC and we were 26 trading days or around 26 trading days from the wavelet top. Now it gets more tricky or difficult because here well I have chosen this point. Thing is as we uh, at, when we were around in the middle of this c uh, consolidation period we knew we had a 
wave the top we knew we were looking for some kind of a, a decline or consolidation but you know when it gets a bit out in this period and you see nothing bearish has happened you should know this will be probably a sideways correction and then you look for something like this and then already you don't wait until the end point before before you start looking for a low and, and put your long positions because you know the low will probably be earlier so where would you have put your long positions here I don't know maybe somewhere at this point already you knew this this was not ending bearish and then we have the next one another tr very tricky one a bit similar to this one so you know when you were at this point well here it started to look bearish you know you could wonder are we starting to look for something like this but now we popped up to higher highs and at that point you know no you knew nothing bearish is happening here this is some kind of a sideways consolidation and actually that's how it turned out now I remember I think I was kind of suspecting a three drive top here uh, but uh, th this wavelet is not suggesting we are at the top rather at the low I thought we sometimes these wavelets are wrong uh, and, and they suddenly the market does something unexpected and the wavelet adjust after that so I guess I expected the wavelet was telling me the, uh, the, the wrong story maybe this was a market top but uh, you know it, it wasn't a top it, we were this wasn't a top it st stretched all the way up, up into here so again looking for lows I'm placing this here and the m it, it tells me look for a low at this point now here we are currently at this point um, so it was too early to expect a low so what happened well we had a double low you see well, that was too early for a low and then we had a double low that's where you wanted to go long and then the next one again tricky here um, this was a market low did I expect it well I kind of I saw <laughs> I felt there was an ABC pattern here the, 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 the bounce here is, is very sabotaged but I'm, I think I called this low pretty well and one of the things I was looking for is, is this symmetry here this was a bit unusual pattern here because we topped out so early but I said uh, this could be some kind of a low here and we bounced and you know placing it here at this point I, s I felt something was wrong here that this low was too early this looked more like a shoulder and we see the yellow wavelet was topping out so that's what happened we, we flushed down to a, another low and here the wavelet l again looks very tricky S something's wrong here I suspected it will would be a low here we would rally and the wavelet would, would end up to look something like this and we see here 26 trading days so the low was a bit later but uh, what I was expecting here was a double low and that would have been 26 trading days or a little bit more but actually we, we, we flushed down to a lower low and how did it end up well I expected the wavelet to end up something like this and well I wasn't exact spot on but very close and this market low it was later than 26 trading days actually here we made a low using bear market rules that's around 34 trading days so here we have uh, also a small ABC within this leg here we have a small ABC this is a bigger ABC and even bigger ABC now it, this may not look like an ABC but uh, you know this wavelet tells us A B C so see ya